Prince Harry's former aide has launched a stinging attack at the Duke, saying he no longer has a purpose, it has been reported. The Duke of Sussex will be hitting a milestone birthday on September 15, as he will turn 40. Harry has been estranged from the royal family and the life he used to have in the UK after he sensationally quit his duties and moved to the US with wife Meghan Markle in 2020. Since then, the couple have made a string of bombshell claims against the Rorals through a series of interviews, their Netflix show Harry and Meghan, and Harry's explosive memoir Spare. But according to the Times, the people closest to him now say the Duke is at a crossroads. One of his former aides told the outlet, What is the purpose of Prince Harry and what is Prince Harry's purpose? He loved the army and was very good at his job. The work with Invictus is great and fatherhood was the role he most wanted, so perhaps those are enough for him. But everything else is a bit woolly, I always thought he wanted more from life. I can't help but think he must be wondering, where do I go from here? Meanwhile, Prince Harry was reportedly pushed by his ghostwriter to write bombshell details in his book. The Duke of Sussex, who released his memoir Spare in 2023, revealed explosive details about his life in the royal family. It is not shared that the Duke was coaxed to add such incidents in his book. Royal author Marina Hyde shares that Junior Moinger wanted Harry to be his deal's elf. She said, he was chosen because his Agassiz book is amazing and you wouldn't think, I mean Agassiz was this great tennis player, he was showman, but the biography, the autobiography is absolutely brilliant. The greatest ghost writers and clearly what happened with Moringer who gave some interviews after having done Spare, said he really pushed Prince Harry to say more and more about certain things. Miss Hyde added, right at the end when you've built up a long time of talking to someone maybe in their house over many many hours over some months, they come back and there's a sort of dump of all the really intense personal stuff that is going to be the bit that's in all the headlines and is filleted out of the serializations.